The 66 points the UL smacked on New Mexico State was the most around the FBS Saturday. Homecoming turned out to be a coming out party for several Cajuns, but as Mike Carter tells us, no one shined brighter than the man under center. For the first time this season, the Ragin' Cajuns had a 300-yard passer, a 100-yard receiver, and a 100-yard rusher. But nothing stole the show like Andre Nunez's five touchdown passes on Saturday, tying Jake Delhomme's 1996 school record and proving that Billy Napier's offense is firing on all cylinders. I think Andre is a product of great preparation, a great offseason. From day one, he's been one of the hardest workers uh, on our football team. He had a tremendous offseason physically, but in general, uh, he knows how to be a student of the game. He prepared well this week. He practiced really well. Um, and a lot of players played well around here. I mean, I think it was just, you know, preparation with practice, you know, trusting my offensive line and you know, trusting my guys on the outside. So I think it, it, it's a product of our practice and you know, how hard we work. You know, typically at quarterback, you know, you're dependent on a lot of people. So I think his teammates play, played well around him and he, he's been a very capable guy. I told you guys that from the beginning. I think he's pretty talented and can do can do well going forward. I mean, you know, that, that's what happens when you just, you know, prepare the way you do and, you know, you got guys around you who, who can help. Now, Billy Napier was quick to downplay his team's offensive output on Saturday night, saying, look, you can't take the points with you from week to week, and it would be something for the Cajuns to remember next week when they play Appalachian State. The Mountaineers already with a 72-point game under their belts, certainly with enough firepower to keep up with a now high-flying Louisiana team. At Cajun Field, Mike Carter, KATC Sports.